Thank you, Mo. Colorectal cancer is the third leading cause of cancer deaths in both men and women across the country. Latrice Curry joins us now with more in her eye on health on how doctors are trying to raise awareness. Well, Cindy, we often hear the phrase it's preventable, beatable and treatable. But a local doctor says that's why getting that colon screening is so important. More and more people are listening to the warning signs when it comes to preventing colorectal cancer. More people who can tell me the age they ought to be screened, which is 50. But in the last couple of years, we've had sort of some new information. And for that reason, people are maybe just a little confused. Dr. Lorenzo Rivero says while 50 is the average age for a healthy person, some people should be tested earlier depending on their family history and race. However, if you are African American, your age is 45 because you're at a slightly higher risk. And in Chattanooga in particular, we know that our rates of colon cancer are higher than the rest of the country. And especially in African American women, it's twice that of a white woman in Chattanooga. In African American men, it is four times that. Doctors say the majority of cases are what's called sporadic which means during your lifetime, you pick up these cells that cause some mutations to grow faster. So we don't know exactly what causes that, but we do know that it is genetic. Some warning signs of colon cancer are changes in bowel habits, blood in the stool, abdominal discomfort, and weight loss. But unfortunately, by the time the symptoms appear, the cancer is often grown or spread. That's why it's so important to get a colon screening. So I would say the gold standard is colonoscopy. And the reason we like that test is not only can we detect it, but we could remove the polyp before it turns to cancer. You want to catch it when it's a polyp. A polyp by itself is benign, but if you don't remove the polyp, it will turn into colon cancer eventually. Dr. Lorenzo Rivera says it takes five to 10 years for that to happen. In addition to getting screened, Try to make sure you're eating a high fiber diet with plenty of fruits and vegetables. Colon cancer is preventable, it is beatable, it is treatable, but please get your colonoscopy. Well, when it comes to colon screening, there are other options like a virtual colonoscopy and Cologuard. But Dr. Lorenzo Rivera says neither actually removes that polyp. And a reminder, like so many other things that are going on, the rump run scheduled for the end of this month has been rescheduled for the fall.